All right, goose party begins. Got their water and their salad ready, and here they are. Say, well, just waiting for me to get out of the way. Look at that, see that? <laughs> Easter's got a little Canada goose friend. I was trying to break up their salad, and she's coming there eating right from under me. Like she wasn't afraid. But just for fun, I caught her and I gave her a hug and put her down. Now, see, this is where we find out what everybody's pecking order is. See that? She gets her little piece and gets the heck out of there. Oh, uh -huh, now she's got to keep it away from all the others. And then back over here. See, now Easter's too busy guarding me. He wants to make sure I don't pet no other goose. But yeah, it's always my pleasure watching the geese enjoy themselves after I make them a nice big salad. Okay, now little Summer's got to get another one. Let's see how she does, huh? Ooh, just on time for beautiful angel wings. Let's get those beautiful angel wings, huh? Little Easter. Honka, honka. <laughs> honka, honka. Stop, stop. Anyways. Back at the goose pond for our weekly snuggle. But it's kind of muddy up here. Easter's not all that clean. I see a little brown in his feathers, meaning he's been bathing in mud puddles. Hasn't had much fresh water. And he has muddy feet, and he had a muddy wet bottom when I got here. I dried him off, and I held him in my lap for a little while. Yeah, as much as I love the fact that things are warming up in springtime, don't love the mud. Honk, honk, honk. I hear you. <laughs> there she is again, trying to get her bite. But these birds are so dominant and vicious. Hey, you dominant, vicious birds. Who do you think you are? They're all dominant and vicious till I get over too close to them. <laughs> hey, China girl. China girl. Easter duck. All right, well, that's our day. If I get anything else interesting, I'll tape it, but I might limit it to one video today because it's really muddy and I want to go home. <laughs> that's my story. Yeah. But the ice is still on the pond and they got that one little drinking hole, so I would like to assume that these birds are going to enjoy having a bird bath for right now. That's the idea. Now they got grass shown, but I don't think it looks very good and edible yet. So again, it's where the green stuff comes in. You know what? They'd probably be happy if I brought this any time of year. I was just thinking all winter it would be a good supplement for their lack of grass. But maybe on a nice sunny day I'll bring some down and see how they like it. And it just might be as popular as it is right now. Okay, well, hope you enjoyed our little video, and I will be signing off.